Good morning. Today we are going to look at AMI Day 19, and I'd like to start by reading the problem. It says, here is a graph that represents function f, which gives the height of a drone in meters t seconds after it leaves the ground. So it says decide which function value is greater. Um, it says f of 0 or f of 4, f of 2 or f of 5, f of 3 or f of 7, f of t or f of t plus 1. So I would like to start with the first one, and I'll do this in blue. So um, f of 0 or f of 4, what that's going to mean for us is when t is 0, compare that to I'm going to change this to a different one. When t is 0, that's still not working. When t is 0 or when t is 4, um, f of 0 is going to be the height and 0 is the time. f of 4 is going to be the height four seconds after the rocket was launched. So what we need to do is compare, I'm just gonna trace this up right here, right? Which value is going to be greater? Um, in other words, which, at which time is the rocket higher in the air? When t equals zero, the rocket is still down here on the ground. At one second, it's going up. Two seconds, it's reached this height. And if you'll notice, there's no height value written here. We don't know how high it up. We've just got little increments here. It doesn't say that it's five feet up or 10 feet up. We don't know. Um, but it reaches its maximum height up at two seconds. It stays at that height until it's been in the air for five seconds. After five seconds, it begins coming back to the ground. And then it lands on the ground after seven seconds. So on number one, it says f of zero or f of four. After four seconds, the drone is in the air or is higher in the air than it was after zero seconds. So for the first one, our answer is f of, f of four is greater than f of zero. Now for number two, you're going to compare f of two and f of five. So you'll see the y value there, the height, how high up is it after two seconds? Compare that with how high up it is after five seconds. Um, for number three, you'll do f of three and f of seven. And you'll compare those two, which one is higher up? or at which, at which time is the drone higher up in the air. And lastly, for number four, this one's a little bit trickier, um, but when it says f of t or f of t plus one, we can plug in whichever numbers we would like. So um, for example, if we said that t equals one for the last one, um, then t plus one would equal two. So compare um, f of one to f of two. Which one is, at what time is the drone higher in the air? You could also follow that same pattern and do when t equals six, uh, t plus one is going to equal seven. So which one is, um, at which one of these times is the drone higher up? At f equals six or at f equals seven? So um, I want you guys to think about that. Again, number four is a little bit trickier, but you'll do number two, three, and four. We've already done one together. And this is, again, just asking at which time is the drone higher up in the air? Please let me know if you guys have any questions and I'm happy to help you. Um, please reach out to me or your math teacher. Um, I hope you guys have a really good day and let us know if you need anything.